Um, you know, both you and your brother, in fact, have spoken up about the support California to support California's Governor Feinstein on the assault weapon ban. Can you talk about the gun laws and your perspective on that? Yeah, I mean, Texas. There's no doubt that that Texas has a gun culture, um, and I'll say that I I don't I support people being able to hunt with guns. Um, the Supreme Court has interpreted the Second Amendment to say that people have a right uh, to bear arms, regardless of whether they're in a militia or not. So you're not going to get rid of the Second Amendment. People are going to have the right to bear arms. The question is, are there reasonable uh, limits on that right so that we can have a safer America, safer for our children, safer in our workplaces, in our, uh, in our public places? So I think that, that there are reasonable steps that we can take, you know, closing that gun show loophole. What sense does it make that we have all of these restrictions if you go to a gun shop, but somebody can go to a gun store and be a terrorist or a gangster or mentally or whatever and, and buy a gun? It doesn't make any sense. Um, secondly, uh, dealing with the issue of high-capacity magazines, the thing that the, that the NRA can never answer is that the, the challenge you have is the element of surprise in any, any encounter. So when Representative Giffords was approached by the young man who you know, had a similar assault weapon, I mean, the guy can get off 30 rounds before anybody can do anything. You, there's a security guard there. You're always going to have that element of surprise. And what you want to do is you want to be able, in a reasonable way, to limit how damaging somebody can be in that kind of moment. Um, uh, on top of that, I think that... Uh, ensuring that there's better collaboration between states and the federal government so that databases are up to date, uh, that they are thorough, uh, so that when a gun check, when, a, when an ID check is done, um, you know, it's as thorough as possible. I don't think that we're as thorough as we could be right now.